Hey, welcome back. Welcome to our, another episode in our video. Um, I have another case here uh, at the shop that I worked at. Um, I have a 2017 um, uh, Volkswagen Tiguan. Uh, this this car is a uh, leaking transmission fluid and uh, I came here for that and uh, I'm trying to look for the fluid where it's coming from and uh, surprisingly it's not a common issue on this so whatever happened to it why it's causing why it's leaking uh, we're about to find out but uh, let me show you what I did so basically the leak is coming from the the line on the uh, transmission of Dillery. So right there inside. Yeah, that's the auxiliary. So the leak is coming from the line. Let's see, all right, let's see, see that line is wet. So it's coming from there. Uh, somewhere and it's hard to see from here so since that I am replacing that auxiliary because it's a that line is a part of that auxiliary I have to remove this fascia this uh, bumper cover out and uh, replace it and then I'll be able to show you where it's leaking from now to remove this fascia I don't know if you know if anyone of you out there knows about this yet but Basically, I took the undercover out. This panel, that lip, is have a plastic clip inside. Be careful, because uh, when they get old, they get brittle, and I actually broke two. But I fixed it, fixed it with plastic weld. And um, so they just snap in. Once you get that off, you get bolts, screws, there that you have to remove to you're actually gonna just separate this so there's two bolts here on that fender liner that connects to the bumper cover and another bolt right there so two bolts to the fender liner another bolt behind the fender liner that holds the bumper cover once you get that out you actually snap this out towards you be careful so what I do is um, I hold it from under, from the bottom and on this side and kind of work my way out to uh, snap it off because those are just plastic piece that snaps on and then you have bolt screws on top, three screws on top and that's about it. Now I'm going to show you how it looks when I separate this. I actually got this up. There's this, uh, don't forget, don't just pull it. There is a uh, side marker here. And to remove this, you just, you actually just have to pull it. You don't have to twist it. Uh, same on the other side. So once you have that out, get your bumper cover out the way. And there it is. This is what I'm replacing, as you can see. That's how it looks like when it's removed and then you can replace your headlights if you have to remove your headlights and all that. But what I wanted to show you is what's causing the leak. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, let me see. Do you see that screw right there that my light is shining? That screw out there is actually what's causing our leak. For some reason, this car might have got into an accident before. Alright. Oh, that's kind of hard to set my light. Yep, it is hard to set my light, but uh, be patient with me. Okay, so right there yeah right there that screw actually let me snap that picture
All right, that screw actually punctured this line and that's where it's coming, where the fluid is coming out of. So I guess all that movement, rubbing and all that, eventually, eventually it punctured it and started leaking. So, uh, a bit, not, not much, not much tedious work, but in this case, I'm gonna rep replace the uh, transmission uh, filter as well and remove the pan, remove the filter and uh, replace it with the fluid and just to be sure that you know we we are covering covering anything out there because they drove the car with this fluid leaking so hopefully everything works out and uh, get, get to uh, enjoy this car again it's a nice car so I don't see anything wrong you know keeping it, it only has 50,000 miles in there so hopefully the transmission is still good and like I said be able to drive the car again all right well thank you for watching my video again uh, I really appreciate you guys uh, uh, watching my videos and uh, liking it and sharing it and hopefully anyone out there you know who, who may benefit from this uh, hopefully I was able to help you out all right thank you till next time bye